guys. So I was tagged by Dave Cad. Oh, my book almost fell off my lap. Then. Dave Cad blogs to do this question thing. So here we go. Yeah. Thanks, Dave. That was awesome of you to do. Don't know why I'm talking my hands again. Always happens. Also, hair new. This is this is new hair. Well, it's not new. It's not a wig, but it, it's it's like a new haircut. Okay, I'll stop. First question. What is your best and worst year at school? My best would have been sort of primary school. Year, year five, year six. I loved primary school. Seriously, it was my favourite time. Just, all, I just loved primary school. And I guess like in primary school you always complain. But I loved it. I, I just adored it there. So yeah, primary school. Secondary school was my worst. As a lot of you guys know, I was bullied a lot in secondary school, pretty much all the way through, and it sucked. So let's not get into that. I have a whole video, I'll link it here. It wasn't fun. What haircut would you like to be able to pull off? Now, I don't really know, to be honest. I. <laughs> it's really hard to think of one. I guess I'd like to be able to pull off a really, really, like, tiny pixie. So like maybe something like Emma Watson's here. I just can't. My face is just not the right shape to pull it, that sort of thing off. It just doesn't really work like that. I mean, I can't change the face of my shape, so... The face? What? The shape of my face. The shape of my face. That's words. They're so difficult. If you could live as a character from any movie, who would you be? So I would have to say Jo from Little Women because she, I don't know, I can identify with her the most out of most characters. She has the same aspirations as me, she is pretty much like me. I see a lot of myself in her, which is strange for some some reason. I just like, I can never really relate to a lot of movie characters, but with her I definitely can. So yeah, I love the time period, I love the clothes, I love that she's not perfect and she has her own flaws but she gets through them and she manages to be happy and just well and I think it's really lovely that you can do that, you know? Like, I just think that's really nice. Make up a word. Shoe for loofing. I will work out how to spell that later. And that's like, you know, when you're walking along and your feet just slip out of your shoes and you have to sort of stop and like move your feet Slip your feet back in your shoes. Shoe for loofing. There we go. Amusement park or bed? Bed. No hesitation there. Bed. Just, I like a bed. I do. Ooh. Someone's texting me. I'm popular. Well, not really. Something about you that not many people know. Hmm. I am a Christian. I have been a Christian for a very long time. Actually, yeah, I became, I properly became a Christian, gave my life to God when I was 13, and then when I was 14 or 15 I got baptised, and now I go to church and do the Christian thing. What I would say though, is I'm not religious, I just love God. I tend to just, you know, love everyone and respect people. Unfortunately, Christians don't really get a lot of respect. But yeah, I totally understand when people, some people don't like Christians because I've met some real idiots that are Christians. And you, you get the holier than thou ones and you're just like, dude, what's your problem? It's alright, I've met a lot of them, but I'm not one of those, so... Good. Thank you for tagging me and I will tag... Let me think about this one. Who am I going to tag? Hmm. 